Hi guys, what's shaking baking? It's been forever since I talked to you guys. I hope you guys are having a great 2020 so far. My 2020 is interesting so far, but I will go into more details in a few minutes. So, these appearances usually are your cue that Jeff is up to no good and is cooking up some stuff. You're definitely 100% spot on correct. So I have a major announcement that will get you guys hyped along with a few non-major but minor announcements. I am headed to Costa Rica, yeah, you heard me. Costa Rica is gonna be just a week. My folks and I are leaving at the end of March or on March 29th till April 5th. But, I also have a big problem. April 5th is Wrestlemania, so that's my big problem even though I have the WWE Network, I am just praying my home flight isn't in the evening. No details where we are going are official yet, all I know is that we land in Liberia, sorry if I butchered the pronunciation, and we are headed fully west to the Pacific Ocean then going northwest. That's all I know. I am stoked. Originally, I wasn't in the Costa Rica mood. I wanted Hawaii or San Diego, but my mom for some reason had a bee in her bonnet and was craving Costa Rica. Ultimately, I lost that battle. So, we are definitely doing horseback riding. We are debating if it's on a beach or not. That's my top list to do. Also, we are looking at a volcano tour. No clue how I am going to do that if it's massive hills. We are probably going to try renting a TV but in buggy style. We have no clue if I can ride double so I found buggies that fit up to five people. My mom wants to zipline which is shocking to my dad and I. But, the number one thing I am totally hyped up for is seeing and possibly feeding capuchin monkeys. I am really stoked. Quick funny story, I had a nurse named Mary that took me to school twice a week. Her ultimate goal in the future was a helping capuchin monkey. Now, I have a funny plan if we do see them, as soon I see one, I am gonna text a pic to her with a caption. Look Mary, I have a helper monkey, she will go out of her mind, it will be funny too, we are trying to get my brother and his wife to join us half or at the end of our time, they are possibly doing South America between our trip, we were thinking. Instead of heading straight home, they could make a pit stop Costa Rica, right now, they are undecided. Last we heard, it was a 50-50 shot of them joining us but, I doubt it, I will be shocked if they decide we will come. I am definitely deciding if I still bring my big honking camp order, you guys are probably saying, huh? Why no camera? I want to experiment my iPhone 11 video photo quality outdoors. It will be a test how well my iPhone 11 storage does. If I pass, my main goal is less camp order activity on my 2021 Disney trip. It's wicked heavy. So, Costa Rica will be my little experiment. I might pack it just in case or just abandon it for a week, I am still deciding. Now, for three minor announcements, I am headed to Fenway in June 2nd see James Taylor, I am excited, he's with Sean Colvin and Brandy Carlisle, that will be interesting, then, we are headed to Rhode Island for two weeks in August, no clue when in August definitely beach and a recap of JT, Sean Colvin and Brandy Carlisle vlogs are coming in the future. 
Two new vlogs are on standby, both are huge and very long, just waiting till I get my clearance from YouTube. The ETA for them is to be determined definitely spring is my goal to premiere one or two of them. I have been grinding Ghost Recon Breakpoint that I got for Zmas, awesome game, I am absolutely loving it, it's a bit more interesting than Wildlands but I totally love Wildlands. The only one thing I am not liking so far is no squad members are with me, I am solo with flashbacks of my crew, I am hoping I have a squad down the road, but I don't think so, again, I just started December 26th I think, I forget. Now, I have a serious thing that I haven't told you guys about, fair warning, it's sad, scary, and R-rated, we had a little Nelly incident that required emergency surgery two Sundays ago, no worries, she's getting better. Two Saturdays ago my folks were walking the girls before dusk, one of our neighbors has a path that cuts through Glen Ellen Golf Course and through their driveway. They yelled, hey Sandy, we are cutting through so they wouldn't scare her. One of her dogs attacked poor Nelly in the stomach. Nelly also got a fever that night as well. She needed surgery the next morning. She has a big gash and a medium chunk of her stomach hairless. They put a drain in for three, five days, it came out last Monday, she had her stitches till MLK we just took off the big cone an hour ago. She was mobile less for a few days, started doing better that Tuesday, by that Wednesday, she was perky and doing minimal stairs. She's was on meds, it's still kinda a shock. The Tufts vet said if we didn't rush her on that Sunday, she wouldn't have made it a week, she had minor blood. We took turns checking up on her during Saturday night, overall, she's wicked lucky she is still alive, thank god that the dog didn't attack her neck or she wouldn't be here. Sorry that I was silent didn't want to freak or shock anybody, she's already back to her security alarm self with any. So, that's how I kicked off my 2020, if you are in Costa Rica, please PM me tips what to do, again, I am totally hyped, should be a blast, I hope you guys are behaving, I will be back to my regular vlogging schedule in the near future, now. Things just are crazy between Nelly, Vacations, James Taylor and other stuff, so, that's why I haven't posted anything new. Thanks for letting me update you guys on stuff, I hope I see you in the future, have a great night. Peace.